everybody. Hope you're doing well today. Welcome to my channel. I'm Lorraine. Today I would like to do a straight pour and what I have mixed up. This is the Deco Art Flow Acrylic White and I put about a tablespoon of satin enamel in here. So I'm looking to get a little bit of clouds. I have a quinacridone magenta. As you can see, these are a kind of a medium thick. These are kind of a medium consistency. They're leaving a little mound and then disappearing. This is a violet by Master's Touch. So rich. And this is the Deco Art Metallic Peacock Pearl. It is just such a gorgeous color. I just love this color. It's a metallic aquamarine type of color. It's gorgeous. I have an 11 by 14 inch canvas and I'm going to fill my cup. I'm going to put just a little bit of my uh, satin enamel paint in the bottom. Okay, that's on the outside. Just enough to cover the bottom. And I'm going to go... Hmm. I think I'll start with a little bit of the violet. And I'm going to do just a touch of the satin enamel in between each color. Not a lot of it. Get rid of these sticks, make it a little easier on me. Put a layer of my peacock pearl. Already getting little cloudies in my cup. I probably have way more paint than what I need for this canvas. Sometimes it's better to have too much than not enough. And with the quinacridone magenta. Okay, so here we go. Pour it right in the middle. And shaking a little bit. I'm going to try and hold it steady here. Not seeing much of that peacock pearl in there. I'm hoping when I stretch it out, it'll show up. Lot of white right in the middle. Okay. Oh, it's so pretty, a little feathery. A little feathery things going on in here. They're gorgeous. Pop the air bubbles. It's 
Let's see if I can give you a close-up look of it right now. Okay. I'm going to put some white paint around here so that it doesn't roll too much. Just going to give it a good... A little something to help it move. Colors are so pretty. I don't want to lose any of it. I'm just going to move it very slowly. Especially, I don't want to lose that center. It's so pretty. Going to be very patient here. Move it very slowly. Okay, I think the weight of my paint is right there. Yes, it definitely is. So I'm going to bring it down to that corner. Bring it 
back, get the weight of that paint back to the center. Really, really love this side over here. It's gorgeous. All of those colors together are just absolutely beautiful. Move it down to this corner. Very slowly. Just get it over. Alright, I'm going to bring the weight of my paint back to the center. This is so pretty down here. I think I'm going to tilt it back this way a bit. Bring it down some. Sorry if you can't see that. I want to stretch these cells out here a little bit. Probably could have done without the white at the bottom of the cup. So there's a lot of that, and I'm going to bring it out, get rid of some of it. Just let some of that go off the edge there. Okay. Give it a quick look. And this is just absolutely beautiful over here. I like the way that this is opening up. So I'm going to bring some of it down. To open some of that up. And then I'm going to bring it back. And hopefully I can get a nice even look on the top and the bottom. I'm so happy with the way this turned out. There's still a little bit too much paint on there. So I'm going to tilt it down, tilt off the part, the white part, because I really don't care for that as much as the rest of it. Just tilt that on down. Oh man, so pretty. Put it down this way a bit. Sorry if you can't see this for just a second here. There we go. Bring it back a bit. I absolutely love it, love it. I'm going to move it this way a little bit just to make sure the weight of my paint is even because I moved everything down to this end. I want it to dry nice and evenly. Cells are staying nice shape. My lines are staying real nice shape. I think that's good right there. Well, let me know what you think, guys. This one, I'm really happy with it. I'm going to give it a quick torch just to get some air bubbles out. I don't want to have too many little white things popping up, but it's gorgeous. I just love it. Thanks for coming and visiting with me tonight, guys, or today. Appreciate it. If you like my videos, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe. That helps my channel out quite a bit.